South National University in South Korea is offering a fully funded scholarship for undergraduate studies as well as for graduate studies. So there are two types of scholarships or there are two ways you can apply for. There are five different scholarships that you can apply for before application. What this means is even before you submit your application to the university, you can apply for these scholarships here. And after the deadline have passed or when you have already submitted your application, you can apply for these other scholarships after admission. There are four scholarships you can apply for after admission. The same can be said for their undergraduate programs. They have scholarships you can apply for before application and scholarships you can apply for after admission. Let's take a look at the scholarships that um, you can apply for, for graduate studies, for master's and PhD before application. You're eligible to apply for the SNU President Fellowship Program if you're a faculty member of a major university in a developing country without a PhD degree. And if you're a newly admitted student at SNU as a PhD student. So the benefits of the scholarship are you get the full tuition fee coverage. You benefit from living expense up to 1 million 500 Korean won to 2 million Korean won for three to four years. And you benefit from a round trip flight. You also have the opportunity to learn Korean language as well as your national health insurance fee reimbursement. There are eight of the scholarships that are awarded each semester. This is wonderful. And vacation period for this scholarship is when the admission period for international students are open that is every semester there are more details here i'll leave the links in the description so i'll urge you to check it out now let's look at um, another scholarship which is available for master's students um, we have the graduate scholarship for excellent foreign students so if you're a known korean you're eligible for this scholarship there are about 20 of them that are awarded uh, each time and it covers your tuition fee and your living expense you get 500,000 Korean won per month and you can apply for this one when the application portal is open every semester. So this is wonderful. We also have the Silk Road Scholarship. This one is also for applicants from countries in the Silk Road region who want to study humanity or social sciences including Korean language, history, culture, politics and economics. The five of the scholarships that are awarded and is fully funded so there are all the scholarships that I would like you to take a detailed look at it. And remember, all the scholarships I've mentioned are the scholarships you can apply for before application. And now after you've submitted your uh, application for admission, you can still apply for these other scholarships. They have the, the SNU Global Scholarship, which is if you're an international student, you can apply. There are approximately 160 of these scholarships that are awarded and is fully funded. Tuition fee, living expense, airfare, housing cost, and the rest. So this is wonderful. You can apply for this. If not, you can have the Glow Harmony Scholarship. It's also fully funded. The application period is from January and July. So now is the best time to apply for these scholarships. You can check out any of the scholarships you think is your best fits you and you apply for so the scholarships i've mentioned they are for masters if you're going in for undergraduate the procedure is the same they also have fully funded scholarships here that you can apply for like the korean government scholarship program the application period will open in september so you can apply to this university and in september you apply for this scholarship and now we are looking for the scholarship before application so they are the rest of the scholarships you can apply for any of the scholarships and even after you have gained your admission you can apply for these other scholarships so this is wonderful i will encourage you to check it out the scholarships and find which is okay for you and you apply and generally to be eligible for this scholarship you need to meet all the entry requirements for the for this university by february 28 2023 you need to have if you're applying for a master's studies you need to hold a bachelor's degree and if you're applying for a PhD, you should hold a master's degree. 
and um, you have to be an international student none of your parents need to hold a korean nationality they all have to be foreigners in summary and you have to complete the online application and then you follow up the remaining steps i'll leave the links in the description but it's quite simple you need to prepare your application form a personal statement two letters of recommendation and then a proof of language proficiency in english or korean if you want to study in korean but of course if you're international you want to study in english you need to show proof of uh, language proficiency and then uh, that's basically it you have to prepare your documents such as your certificates your bachelor's or your master's depending on what level you want to study now let's quickly take a look at the application period the application window is currently open that is for spring 2023 now is the time to apply and the period of application is from the 4th of july to the 13th of july this window or this portal is going to close at 5 p.m korean time so depending on when you're watching this video you have to take action immediately it's a simple online application and the first step is you have to create your account and then you submit the application documents just by scanning and uploading you don't need to do anything special your application will only be considered upon payment of the application fee that is 90,000 korean won and after this payment has been made you can be sure that you will gain a place or your application will be considered so you submit the online application you provide the letters of recommendation that is between the 4th of july to the 15th of july you have to you have to still submit your portfolio and the preliminary admission decision will be made on the 7th of october they'll let you know about your can your application and then you get the final decision by november 25th so registration for enrollment is going to take place between december 2022 and february 2023 and then you have to do the korean proficiency test in february 2023 so um snu will contact successful applicants who are required to take the korean proficiency test so if your program you applied for is in korean you have to take the test but of course if it's english good luck my friend so that is simply it you can download this guide here in english it's in english and in korean so you can download this guide and follow the steps and once that is done the next thing if you want to apply it's quite simple you just need to click on proceed to the next page this will take you now to the official portal here where you have to create your account since you're a first time applicant and then you prepare the documents for the online application then you submit that is it so friends check out the scholarship like i mentioned there's so many of them and now encourage you to check out which one fits you then you apply for it thank you for watching this video so far if you enjoyed this video be sure to drop your comment in the section and let me know if you have any questions